What is up guys, welcome back to another video. This is Essence of Clutch. And today, before this video starts guys, I just want to say a big thank you to each and every one of you. We've hit 10,000 subscribers. That is crazy. 10,000. I guess the next milestone is 100k, 100,000. I don't know how long it's going to take us to get there, but we're going to get there one day. 100k, that's the next goal. Let's get it. But anyway, in today's video, I've got a dribble tutorial for you guys. In my last video I asked you if you wanted to see it and a lot of you commented wanted to see this dribble tutorial so you know I gotta bring it for you. I've even got the controller cam, ooh, I know right, next level. Alright, for you guys who didn't see my last video, this is the dribbles I'm using. If you wanna do what I'm doing, you just gotta put these dribbles on. You can switch it up a bit, put some of your own dribbles in if you want, but this is what I'm using. Right, I guess we just start with ISO crossovers. I mean, it's pretty easy to do an ISO crossover. I think all of you guys know how to do it. You're just running down the court and you hit the right stick away from the ball hand. So the ball's in my left hand. I just hit it right and I just do the crossover. It's in my right hand now. I hit it left, I'll do the crossover. You can sprint and do it. Or you can not be sprinting and do it, it doesn't matter, it's just an ISO crossover. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure all you guys know how to do that, so I don't know why I said that. Um, <laughs> okay, ISO behind the back, I guess we would just go through everything though, ISO behind the back. So go down the court, don't hold sprint, don't hold R2, just go down the court and hit the right stick back. So you just hit that right stick back and you do that behind the back move. Going down the court, no sprint. If you hold a sprint, you do this. You do that pullback. So, don't hold sprint and just behind the back. Alright, so spin's pretty simple. <laughs> That's just spinning your right stick. If you're not moving, you'll just do this. That spin, standing still. If you are moving, you'll get a moving spin like that. Right, that ISO hesitation that everyone uses, the normal one. All you do is when you're running sideways, you got to be holding R2. You've got to be sprinting. Running sideways, just flick that right stick backwards. Flick it down. And then you just get that step back. And you can shoot off that. And you can brick it like that. Alright, this is the Rhythm Dribble Elite 7 where you get a speed boost out of. All you have to do is just flick the right analog stick up. So that's all it is. Without holding sprint, without holding anything else, just flick that up. Flick it up, hold sprint, go. Flick it up, hold sprint, go. Flick it up, then just hold sprint. So if you don't hold R2, you won't speed boost. You'll just do this. You've got to hold R2 afterwards. So you just flick that right stick up and you're gone. Because after a while, people will just start, like, it's in my left hand, people will just start, stand to my left. Because I can't do anything, I'll be running there, and I can't speed boost, because I can only go that way. But if you wait just a little bit longer, he flicks it behind his back, and then go this way. If you know what I mean? And it's pretty unstoppable. It's pretty unstoppable at the moment. There's not much people can do. Because if people are giving me right right now, I can go right. If they're cutting off right... They're cutting off the right. I can just go left. And yeah. Alright, so do your crossover size up combos. Whatever it is, you can have any crossover size up combo equipped. I have Stephen Curry, but you can have anything to do that. So the ball's in your left hand, right? You flick the right stick up diagonally. So this way, up diagonal to the right. If it's in your left hand, there, and then the left diagonal, so, there, there. This Wait. is a Chucky Beat production. There, there. See? So my right hand, I flick it left diagonal, right diagonal, left diagonal, right diagonally up. And if it's in my left hand, right diagonally up, left diagonally up. And you do that cross-up, size-up combo that takes the ankles at the park. Um, yeah, that's how you do it. So, if it's in... If the ball's in this hand, 
right, left, if it's in the right hand, left, diagonally up, and then that way. Alright, to do your hesitation inside out combos, it's really easy, all you do, you don't hold, you don't hold R2, you don't hold anything, just the right stick, you flick it to the direction in which the ball is in, so if it's in your right hand, just flick that right and you'll hesitate that way, if it's in your left hand, hesitate that way, and you can shoot out of those hesitations. The between the legs size up combos, I've got the Jamal Crawford on, a few other ones that will break ankles a lot as well, so yeah, anyway, it doesn't matter what you have equipped, but this is just how you do your between the legs combos. See it's in my right hand, I flick left diagonally down, and then I just flick down. So, wait, it's in my right hand, left diagonally down, and then down. And you'll just do that Jamal Crawford. That you see will take ankles at the park, so, and if it's in my left hand, you just reverse it, so right diagonally down, and then down. So, right diagonally down, down. Hey, right diagonally down. Hold up, hold up, hold up. It's in my left hand, right diagonally down, and then down. Right diagonally down, down. Easy as that. Then to do your escape dribble, which is a part of your between the legs combos. The ball's in the right hand, diagonal down to the left, and then diagonal down to the right. So diagonal down, left, right. A. And it's if it's in my left hand, diagonal down to the right, then diagonal down to the left. So diagonal down, right, left. And you just do that escape, and you can get a boost out of that. It's really as simple as that. And then the last one, the behind the back combos, is really, really easy. All you do is you just flick the right stick back twice. The dribble stick back twice. Bang, bang. And you can boost out of that. So right stick back twice. And then just boost out of that. R2, boost out of that. And that is really it. Then you just take all those moves that I just showed you and you can just put them in combos. So you can... Um, get ankles at the park I guess but yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed this video this little dribble tutorial if you want to see more of these videos don't forget to subscribe and yeah I'll see you guys next time peace